if you're having to enter a pin when you're trying to add a channel or app, or when you launch the live TV, it says the channels are blocked, so you want to change, reset or remove the pin altogether, then let me show you how to change, remove or disable both the parental control pin or the Roku account pin in under a minute. First, for those of you who want to view a live TV channel, but it says the channel is blocked and it asks for your parental control pin, then you can change the pin or remove it by going to settings, then parental controls, enter the parental control pin, and then press OK. From there you can change the pin to a new one, or you can highlight the reset parental controls, and then press the play pause button 3 times to erase the pin. But if you don't remember your parental control pin, then you can disable it from the same place as the Roku account pin, which is required to add channels and making any purchase. To reset them both, you need to log into your Roku account using any browser. And if you forgot your Roku email, then you can simply go to your Roku TV settings, then system, highlight about, and at the bottom right corner will be your Roku TV email. So now open a browser, go to my.roku.com and log into your Roku account. Then from the My Account page, go down to Pin Preference, tap on Update, and from this page you can change your Roku account pin without needing to enter the old one. Or you can just disable it by scrolling down and selecting a pin is not required to make any purchase or add any channels. After selecting it, make sure to tap on Save Preferences to save your settings. And from the same page, if you scroll down, here you should see an option to turn off your parental control spin too. But in our case, it's currently not loading. If you're having the same issue and can't find the option to turn off parental controls, then the only way to reset it is by resetting your TV itself. And for that, you can just press the reset button that's on your TV's back for about 10 seconds and then set up your TV. After that, you won't need to enter any pin while using your Roku TV. If this was helpful, make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more simple Roku TV guides. And I'll see you later.